it has a wider lower front grille 3d grille with the quattro badge it has the new led matrix headlights with the automatic high beam and integrated fog lights it has also the corner lights of course new shape for the daytime running lights I like the integration to the front grille Audi is the best with the LED technology in my opinion this one has a 360 degrees camera system and also the adaptive cruise control you can also buy the Audi A8 with the remote parking system with the app you can remotely park the car without being in it now this is the 55 TFSI 340 horsepower 500 Nm of torque 0 to 62 in just 5.6 seconds and at the back a brand new design LED tail lights looks fantastic you can also buy it with the OLED technology which is also a new step by Audi it has a rear view camera automatic trunk you can also open it with your foot chrome additions looks fantastic it has a parking sensor of course in the front and in the back nice sunroof there's also a long version available for the Audi A8 lovely rims now let's take a look at the interior of the Audi A8 this is a brand new key by the way looks fantastic you don't need the key it's a keyless entry and keyless start it has also the soft close system and the Audi side assist I really like the Audi virtual cockpit it's, it's standard on the Audi A8 it has a heated steering wheel Alcantara dark headliner and the seats are very very comfortable on this new generation and this is the interior of the Audi A8 let's start this B-stop you can see the air vents it opens right up it has the Audi virtual cockpit 12.3 inch it has the blind spot assist the Audi virtual cockpit is standard now on the A8 it has the shift pedals it has the adaptive cruise control nice perfume system here you have a SD card SIM card USB input you have the wireless charging for your phone a little storage area by the way two cup holders down here with a power outlet here you have the start stop you can turn it off electron can't break the gear lever down for D up for reverse and press it for park there's also the sport mode you can also shift with the shift pedals here you have the start button keyless entry and keyless start you have the parking sensors and the camera system with the 3D view this is just amazing or you can see it like this sides, right angle front, rear everything is possible you have the safety systems volume adjustments the rotary controller is gone now uh, you control all the uh, settings on these screens 10.1 inch 8.6 inch big you have the drive select button here with that you can choose between efficient, comfort, auto, dynamic and individual with the individual you can adjust uh, separately the drive system, the suspension and the steering between efficient, balanced and dynamic and it has the air suspension ESP, front defrost, rear defrost here you have the heated seats, cooled seats, perfume system 
same settings for the passenger and here you have the comfort settings with this screen you can adjust comfort settings for example the four zone climate control is available the seats you have the massage system rest shoulder activation you can adjust the intensity heated seats leg extensions for example you can turn off the start stop you can turn off the lane assist you have the rear sunshade adjustment you can turn off the head up display radio that's for that now here you have the main menu of the car two pages these are the few this is the few on the left you have the main menus you can directly go to these settings the important settings for example the navigation with the Google Earth system traffic information and assist for example the car settings Audi drive select efficiency seats climate control lights and vision background background lighting you have standard colors but you can choose between 30 colors if you want these are the colors parking aid volume drive assist these are the safety systems the drive assist distance warning audi presence sight assist intersection assist emergency assist exit warning risk recommendation there's every possible feature you can look at the settings then you have the normal settings language settings display brightness MMI settings, virtual cockpit settings, languages available. These are the languages available for the Audi 8. And down here, you can set up driver profiles, sound settings, radio navigation settings. It has also the TV. Radio, media phone and navigation it looks fantastic it has also the perfume system located here disc drive settings quattro batch four-wheel drive system it has the very nice looking ambient lighting the steering wheel is new leather stitched double stitching new design looks fantastic in my opinion nice head-up display with the uh, traffic sign information on it virtual cockpit looks fantastic you have the nice little information in the screens dynamic mode now traffic sign assist the safety systems fuel everything is displayed on this even this is made out of glass and when you get close with your finger it lights up you have the memory settings you have the leather, leather stitched door panels and dash even here you have the ambient lighting there's screens in the back there's the nice panoramic sunroof LED lights Alcantara headliner And we are now in the back seat of this Audi A8. It is also available with the long view base. I don't think it's necessary. It looks fantastic. You have the dual screens. You can also uh, remove this and take it home with you. It has the TVs. It has even the ambient lighting down here. Here and on the doors of course. It has the sun shades. Fully automatic so you can experience this better here 
you have the different settings with this system with this uh, touchpad you can adjust different uh, modes on in the car for example you have the seat adjustment you can adjust the front seat if you want like that for example that's one example you can adjust the lights matrix lights background lighting also available heated and cooled seats with the massage system these are the adjustments for the seats you have the storage area down here it is very comfortable here you can also lay down with this the seat goes now automatically forward and I must say this is one of the most comfortable cars in the world it has a cup holders another storage area and a power outlet even this is a touch screen these buttons you can adjust the sun blinds the sun uh, visors you can for example adjust this or the back I really like this LED lighting it's fantastic in this car the screen is a touch screen by the way so you can view different things the programs the list the main menu Google Play Store car settings navigation for example it's now loading zero to six two and five point six seconds the top speed is 250 kilometers per hour the fuel economy is 7.5 liters combined for 100 kilometers the engine is a 3 liter TFSI petrol engine 500 Newton meters of torque full throttle 30 50 70 100 kilometers per hour just like that the kick down has a nice sound to it other than that you don't get the engine sound in the cabin I'm now in dynamic mode then the car is sportier I really like this design uh, language of Audi it looks modern and classy at the same time I really like that it has dual screens 10.1 inch for the main screen 8.6 for the comfort screen for example I turned on the massage system it's now working you can adjust the intensity it has the heated cooled seats down here you can uh, adjust the rear sunshade the head of display you can turn off the, uh, the start stop system you can uh, adjust the rear sunshades even in the doors I really like the ambient lighting it has 30 colors It has 30 colors, it has different teams. It has the traffic sign assist, Audi presense, the car can break in the city for you. I know which speed is uh, allowed in this area thanks to the traffic sign assist. This one has a soft close system also in the car, fully loaded. There's also a long view base uh, available, then you get the full panoramic sunroof. It has the LED matrix light system, 10 times better than the Xenon, uh, Xenon headlights. And they don't uh, break a lot. It has the automatic high beam, so you don't have to do anything. The car, when there's a car coming your way, it adjusts it uh, automatically 
and you don't you don't have to do anything, which is very clever. The car does it on its own, and when you speed, the front of the car lifts up, full throttle. It gives a nice feeling to the driver. There's a new type steering wheel available. It has the air suspension, very comfortable on speed bumps. It wafts about. I really like the driving experience in this car. You can also buy it with rear wheel steering. Fantastic car. You have the shift pedals, you can shift for yourself if you want. It has the adaptive cruise control, you can set up the distance. I now set it up to 130 km per hour. It has also the steering assist, so it stays between the lines, you don't uh, have to do anything. I set it up to 130 km per hour, that's the speed limit here. After a while, uh, you must take over the steering wheel by touching it and then it uh, goes automatically there on its own, again on its own. It has the Audi pre-sense system so when someone gets into your lane it will automatically brake and it has also a new uh, system. The washers for the windscreen are now integrated in the uh, blades themselves, so you have all type, you have all time a uh, clear vision on the road, which is important in my opinion. That's another safety system. Uh, I like to drive my own, so uh, I turned off the steering assist and the adaptive cruise control. The top speed is 250 km per hour. 150, 160, 170, 180 km per hour, just like that. It has the dynamic turn signals in the back and in the front. It has the LED matrix, uh, matrix headlights. You can also buy it with the OLED technology for the rear tail lights. Uh, what? And I really like this dash. It's nicely put together. The quality of the quality of Audi interiors is just uh, mind-blowingly good. I mean, I really like it. The only thing I don't like is that the rotary controller is gone. You must operate every setting now from the screen, but that doesn't matter. That's a small thing. Uh, it uses Google Earth, 10.1 inch for the upper system, for the screen above the uh, this screen. This lower screen is 8.6 inch big. I'm a fan of this new type steering wheel, it gives you a nice uh, feel, it's solid, it looks good, nice materials are used, uh, glass, glass uh, is used, I really like the ambient lighting, 30 colors. It has also the uh, side assist, so when there's someone in, my, uh, in the next lane, it will warm me thanks to the lights in the mirrors, that's also a really clever system. You can also shift for yourself, this 8-speed transmission feels very smooth, 